Hi there, so today's topic is what is cross-brand TTL or also known as XTTL in the Cactus Dictionary. So what it is, or maybe it's better to start off, what is a normal um, TTL for wireless flash? Um, so as you can hear, see here, it's a Sigma camera, the SD Quattro, and I've installed the Sigma XTTL firmware on the V62 here, and same thing here on the receiver. I have also installed the Sigma XTTL firmware, and here, as you can see, I have the Sigma EF630. And of course, the flash is made for Sigma. And all you need to do, of course, as always, is install Tehashu, lock it down, and switch on flash. Oops. And that's to TTL mode. Switch it to RX mode, and it already detects the SA, which stands for Sigma's S, um, TTL system. And on the camera, uh, oops, turn it on here, the front, and then switch on the transmitter. And of course, you also get an SA letter in the camera icon. So, in such a setup, you got a Sigma camera and you got a Sigma flash, and of course, you got the Sigma XTTL firmware which allows you to use the same system and here you see and of course just to show you um, the groups I have all of them in TTL so the flash is exposing automatically according to what the cameras tell it's to fire <clears throat> and now about XTTL so to demonstrate that, we use the same camera, Sigma camera here on the left. And all you do is, I'm just gonna switch off the flash and the transmitter or receiver here. And I'm gonna replace it with a Nikon SB910. So same thing, put it on, lock it down, switch it on. It's in TTL mode and to switch that to RX and you see it auto detect that as a N which stands for Nikon <clears throat> and it's gonna place it here in the same place and same camera same transmitter and I should focus on the black box here as you can see oh it's not focused there you go and same thing, you get a well exposed picture. And why don't at the same time, I also have another V62 here. And now I've got the Canon, let's see, that's the 580X2. Mount it on the camera, lock uh, on the receiver, lock it down, and switch that on. It's in ETTL mode. And switch this to RX mode. And this time you get a C, which stands for Canon. So I'm just gonna place the flash on the left here. Oh, it might be too bright, but let's see how the TTL functions on the Sigma camera. So I'm just gonna focus on the same box here. All right, focus locked. And you get another well exposed picture. And just to demonstrate, uh, this is in group B and this is in group A. So what I can do here to show you is now I have group B switch off. So I only have group A, which is the Nikon flash on the right. So with just the Nikon, let's see, we got a good exposure and we do. And now I'm gonna just Oops, sorry. Uh, switch on to group B, and oops, uh, whoops. The status screen pops up with the new settings that I've made. And you can see it's also in TTL. So now with only the Canon flash here firing at the wall. Let's see, 
and yes, you do also get a well exposed picture. So and that's what is actually the uh, Cactus XTTL, which stands for Cross Brand TTL. So you have a Nikon and also a Canon flash running at the same time, and you are using a Sigma camera. Uh, with the V62 and of course all of those are running on Sigma's XTTL and just to add on top of that you might also have the need for an on-camera flash for field flash and of course you can use um, uh, the Sigma or any of the other two camera uh, flash units even if it's not running on um, Sigma's uh, system and which I should actually demonstrate uh, to first switch on the TX and I'm just gonna grab the Nikon unit here whoops, unlocked it and then mount it on the transmitter locked it down and I have the camera is on and then next is switch on the flash it's in TTL mode and plus put that into TX mode and you can see if I pull that up the flash is N and the camera system is SA which means you can actually have this XTTL not only off camera but also on camera so let me quickly take the same shot here locked then so now you have both on camera and off camera and of course you can switch the group B off and just using the on camera field flash. There you go. So XTTL works both off camera and on camera. So this is the essence of cross brand TTL. So I hope this helps and thanks for viewing the video. Cheers.